Heidi Fang with Shane Del Rosario coming into his fight here at the Ultimate Fighter. And the last fight, obviously, for you was a loss. So coming into this, how is your mental approach going into this fight? Uh, I feel really good. You know, yes, definitely last one was a loss. So I, I definitely have some pressure to make sure that I don't lose again and uh, come out on top. But uh, I feel really good. I had a great training camp, um, very focused. And I have a tough opponent ahead of me. But it's going to be a great night, and I'm excited for the fight. Between you and Pat Berry, you're both kickboxers. You both have the same type of discipline when it comes to the way that you approach the fight. Uh, how do you see this playing out between the two of you? Uh, you know, it's, everyone says that question, and it's definitely going to be a tough fight. And, uh, you know, I think we both resort to kickboxing. Um, just got to keep my hands up, stay relaxed, and don't get caught. You also fought strike force prior to coming into the UFC. What do you think about what's happening with that promotion and the influx of heavyweights that have come into the UFC from it? Uh, you know, Strikeforce is a great stage for me. Uh, it brought me up and it brought me to the UFC, so I'm very thankful for that. Um, but it's also good that all the UFC, uh, you, uh, the heavyweights are under the same banner, so now you can really see who the best heavyweight is, and everyone gets a chance to fight each other. Back when the Grand Prix was going on, you were initially supposed to face Cormier at one point, but then you had a, a tragic accident that kept you out of doing that. Was, is Cormier anybody that you'd be interested in fighting once he comes back to the UFC? Uh, you know, as of right now, I'm just kind of fighting whoever they ask me to and uh, whatever's smart for us. Um, definitely, he's just like me. He's an up-and-coming, um, a great prospect. So, you know, as long as we're both doing good, I, I don't see why someday we won't meet, you know. I know you also trained at Death Clutch uh, prior in the past. Did you ever run across Pat Berry? Did you ever cross paths while training there? Uh, yeah, I went up one camp for a training partner, or as a training partner for Cain Velasquez. And uh, Pat and I were both up there during that camp training. Uh, we got to move around a little bit, but nothing too intense or crazy, you know, just kind of uh, hung out up there. So it isn't awkward for you at all having to go up against him and face him in this fight? No, nah, it's not awkward for me to fight anybody, you know, it's, it's our job and uh, he's a great guy, you know, after the fight, you know, we'll hang out and uh, be friends. Awesome. Well, we wish you all the best and good luck to you in the Thank cage. You. Thank you.